So my friends, you have come here in the presence of God, in the presence of God's minister and in the presence of God's people so that you might give yourselves to each other in holy matrimony. Christ abundantly blesses your love for each other and he's already consecrated you by the sacrament of baptism. And now he strengthens and enriches that sacrament by this holy bond of matrimony. And so out loud in the presence of his people so that they might hear you, I ask you to state your intentions. Jesse and Jennifer, have you come here freely and without reservation to give yourselves to each other in holy matrimony? Yes. yes. Will you love each other as man and wife for the rest of your lives? Yes. yes. Will you accept children lovingly from God and bring them up according to the law of Christ and His church? Yes. yes. I, Jesse. I, Jesse. Take you, Jennifer. Take you, Jennifer. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you. I will love you. And honor you. And honor you. Every day of my life. Every day of my life. I, Jennifer, take you, Jesse. I, Jennifer, take you, Jesse. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you. I will love you. And honor you. And honor you. Every day of my life. Every day of my life. You have declared your consent before God and His church. What God has joined, man must not divide. to you now for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Jesse Newby. Jesse, you may kiss your bride.
Jennifer, I'm so happy. I'm so happy that you found the man of your dreams. And I love you. Beyond words. As I always said. And I finally got a brother-in-law. <laughs> and he's amazing. He's amazing. This is a day that I've been looking forward to for a long time. Now, when my brother f first moved down here, coming up on, I believe, five years now, uh, for me, it was like I was at a loss. Uh, my brother was leaving. I've always looked up to my brother. Never did I think that five years later, that loss would end up being a gain. Because I did not lose my brother, but I did gain a sister.